and welcome here to the Emirates Arena, the and it's a BBL Cup group game clash between the Radisson Red and Glasgow Rocks and the visiting Bebron Sheffield Sharks. Yes, good evening everyone, Mark Woods here and two teams with very different stories in this season's Cup. Glasgow with a 2-6 and six record, already unable to qualify for the quarterfinals from this North Pool and with Eli Pepper and Earl Russell both departing this week. Coach Vance Levante admitting his team in a tough spot, looking to bring in two new Americans before the league starts. It is Friday night basketball, it is very light here at the Emirates Arena, it is the BBL Cup. And it is the Glasgow Rocks preparing for tip-off against the Sheffield Sharks with Maxime Joubala heading for the tip alongside Bennett Cook. It is Rocks against Sharks. And having taken a year out for the game has come back with a real bang this year. Joubala with the stuff. Bunyan is open in the corner. Extends the gap. down to double figures or at least that double figures give and go stuff from Ali Fraser I think you called him no denying it these days and Kunis the kick back Murray the floater teardrop in third quarter of the gap at 11 now a baller stuffs it in well so I'm excited to see what they're going to look like in December. Murray, three points for the chance for four. They have to learn to use, use advantage, seal a little bit more. Murray once again makes it once again. Gareth Murray, 30 points. An old hand, longest serving player at the club. Bunyan, the fake inside, the finish. And the crowd have enjoyed that. 16 year old Callum Mortimer gets his first BBL score of the Rocks over the 100 mark. And that, going back to that, he will never forget that. And the Rocks improve their record in this season's BBL Cup to 3 and 6. Sharks 7 and 3, they finish the group stages. They will finish second in the North Group, the quarter final of the BBL Cup will be at Ponds Forge 1st of December, the date for your diary if you're a Sharks fan. The Rocks now head to Cheshire Phoenix on Sunday and Kieran they'll go with some confidence after tonight's performance. They will definitely go with some, some confidence there. I think for me it stands out is they, they scored 101 points tonight. You know, they've been struggling scoring. They look they look like they're playing free. You know, the, the, the pressure's off them, there, there's no pressure here right now, it's all about rebuilding and I, I, I'm, I'm sure uh, Levande is emphasising that we have to get back to a certain type of level and that's the only way they can go and have success with in the league. That's what their aim is right now, the only way they're going to do that is getting some quality game time experience and getting big wins, getting that confidence, get ready for league play.